I'm so happy they're finally here. Yeah. It's all worth it after all. Oh, yeah. Why don't you unpack baby stuff, not my stuff? Where is that? No, 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 don't take those out, Mason. Did you see mom's diaper? <laughs> Okay. Oh my God. Okay, look at these. <laughs> Mom has a diaper. <laughs> don't tell us that. I can't pack right now. Seriously, I'm gonna have to do this when he's sleeping. No, don't. <laughs> <laughs> look at his sleep. <laughs> Are you wet? <laughs> See, this is why I'm so excited. Right? Like, she's gonna be a great yes. big brother. Thank you. Thank you. And she's gonna be an awesome big sister. Big sister. I am 12 weeks pregnant, and Mason and this baby growing in my belly are growing way too fast. It's so nice to spend some quality time with Tara, especially because she is going through the exact same thing as I'm going through. <laughs> Come on. Whew. Being a little single mom is tough. Especially when I have to go shopping at the grocery store. The simplest tasks for average people can be obstacles for us little people. And especially for me, because I'm only three feet eight. Come here, you want to help mommy? Could you get in the cart for me? Yeah. Luckily, I have Leona to reach the high shelves. Awesome job. Perfect, okay. She's like my little helper. Unload the cart. Oh, yep. Do I look so heavy? Lassie, thank, thank you. you. you guys have a good okay, thank you too. Bye bye. Come on, bud. Here we go, guys. Here we are. We're Coming home. Oh, we're here. All right. Welcome home, baby. Baby. And babies. Baby and babies. It's been brutal to have to leave Kyra and Xavier in the NICU every night and come home without them. But now being released after only two weeks instead of four weeks that we thought, this is beyond exciting. I'm so happy they're finally here. Yeah. It's all worth it after all. Oh, yeah. Their personalities are so different, like, Xavier is so calm and Kyra is a little bit more loud. After the twins were born, they lost a little bit of weight, which can happen to preemies. But now Xavier is finally back to his birth weight, which is four pounds, 10 ounces, and Cairo is four pounds, three ounces. Xavier's feeding tube was taken out and Cairo had to be in incubator for a little bit, but now he's able to finally regulate his own body temperature, so I could not be happier. I was thinking that we would like make a sun and then put all three of our handprints all around the sun. They're not gonna know what's Penny's hand and what's yours. My hand is much bigger than her hand. Mm. Have you seen your hand? I'm eight months pregnant, and in a few short weeks, Penny will have a brother or sister to torment for the rest of her life. So Joe and I are making sure that we do some fun activities with Penny while she's still an only child. Before that day has been, it's gonna be fine. Don't worry, Penny. She wants to like, okay, it's, it's going in, it's going in right here. This is an epic fail already. She is gonna get that everywhere. <laughs> you all right, Penny? <laughs> We're torturing you. Hey. Aw, look at her little orange hand. <laughs> Hey, you're hurting her little paw. I'm not hurting her paw. You're squishing her hand. Looks like you're pulling her arm out of her socket. No, I'm not. Oh my God, what are you doing to her hand? Okay. Wait, she's almost done. You're almost done. Damn you, Pinterest. It may not be a Picasso, but I love it. And now I'll always have Penny's baby hands. I hear you, Penny. <laughs> Don't worry, only 18 more years you have to live here. Look, who is this? Who's that, Pen? <gasps> Look at your face. That's the only one that moves. I don't know, Eric. These are all pretty tight, man. 
Oh. Uh, I see that face. Looks like you got a poop. <laughs> having a blended family together at the same place at the same time is really rare. And having Matt's son, Eric, here from Seattle has been wonderful. And now that Maverick is here, this is what I've pictured for the past nine months. It's just bittersweet because after Eric leaves, I don't know when the next opportunity will be for us to get together and be a family again. Why? Oh! Oh, no. oh no. It's fine. It's fine. Say hi, big brother. Big brother's gonna hold you, kiddo. He's so awake right now. What do you think? I like him. You like him? Well, that's good. Is he cute? Yeah. So hi everybody, my name's Jeff. I'm gonna be your guys' instructor today. What we're gonna be learning today is 95% ASL based or American Sign Language. So that meaning you can go out on the street and you can communicate uh, with the signs I'm gonna teach you today with any deaf person out there. Penny is almost a year and a half and most average age children would be walking and some would even be talking by now. But Akon's developed differently and while she may not be doing those things yet, Penny is really curious about life, and in a couple weeks, she will be signing left and right. Okay, so we've got toilets, right? We've got poop. Poop looks like this, poop, okay? And then how about we finish uh, with I love you, okay? So I love you, the universal gesture for I love you looks like this, all right? I love you. I love you. <laughs> Penny is very smart. Um, she already knows food. She puts her hands up to her mouth when she wants food. She needs to know, like, some of the more important ones, like, rock on! And, like, hang loose. And if she ever needs a ride, she needs to get her thumb going and hitchhike. <laughs> she doesn't. She don't want her to be stranded. Xavier is seriously your little twin. <laughs> you sleepy, buddy? Sleepy baby. My twin baby boys, Cairo and Xavier, are growing up so fast and they are getting so big. And when I was pregnant, I always pictured me and my best friend, Tara, taking our kids to the park for a little play dates. But I realized that Tara already had her son four months ago and our kids never even met yet. And this is not right. <laughs> Bless you. Oh. Bless you. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. <gasps> Hi. Oops. Look. Who is this? Who's that, Pen? <gasps> Look at your face. Are you giving kisses? Kisses to your bro. Mm -hmm. Be nice. Be gentle. <laughs> it's your brother. Play. What? We want to talk to you both about something. Yeah, about what? Your mom is pregnant. You know what that means? That mommy and Matt daddy are going to have a baby. Yay, I'm so excited. You're going to have a baby brother or a sister. Yeah? Are you going to help me take care of it? Yeah, I'll try. Eric, you want to change the diapers? <laughs> Like You're just going to be a good big brother. No diapers for you? Well, good. So you guys know what's going on, and when we find out if it's a girl or a boy, should we let you guys know? Okay! Okay! Oh, you ready for that? Yeah. Wait. Oh. <laughs> All right. That's happiness. That's happy. When you put the six of us in a room, you can't expect every moment to be drama-free. It's perfect if you want to look like the 40-year-old virgin. I've had enough. You've got to be kidding me. 